Morning. We begin tonight getting ready for the sweet sound of jazz music to take over Heritage Park this weekend. It's all part of the 63rd Texas Jazz Fest, which is expected to welcome over 25,000 guests over the course of three days, and it all starts on Friday. That's right. Pair that up with hundreds of folks expected at Concrete Street Saturday for the Willie Nelson concert, and well, that could lead to traffic and security concerns in that part of the city. Today, our Bill Churchill caught up with the president of the festival as well as CCPD to talk about security plans. He joins us live now from Heritage Park. And while all eyes will be on the performances this weekend, CCPD will be keeping a close watch on the crowds, making sure everyone stays safe. It's the longest running free jazz festival in the world, and it's back. Crews spent much of Wednesday doing last minute touches. Our uh, VIP staging going up here. President Nick Martinez says spectators can expect to be entertained by over 50 bands from across the U.S. Bring grandma, grandpa, bring the kids, bring everybody. A family friendly event made possible thanks to the law enforcement keeping a close watch on the big crowds. Martinez says once again, safety will be a top priority. We hire our own security and uh, we also have CCPD working, but we won't have the, the, the tech Texas Guard this year, uh, they won't be able to come. The Guard often providing spectators with that extra sense of security. Despite their absence, there will not be a lack of police officers. CCPD says it will have an additional 60 officers working this weekend. Anywhere from traffic to drone operators. Senior Officer Jennifer Collier says they'll be looking for any troublemakers who might get out of hand, but there is also a big focus on traffic. Drivers slow down, look for pedestrians, but also pedestrians Make sure you look both ways. While they want people to come out and enjoy themselves, if you choose to drink, make sure you are responsible. Make sure you get a designated driver to drive you home. You have a live tech and the police department says to allow yourself plenty of time to get to where you need to be. Expect traffic just driving over here this evening with the typical traffic you expect. There were plenty of red tail lights out there. Now the CCRTA will be providing free park and ride shuttles. Take a look on your screen. They run from Friday through Sunday to Heritage Park. Parking areas include City Hall, the Nueces County Courthouse, and Texas A&M Corpus Christi. Reporting live, I'm Bill Churchwell. Now back to you. All right.